A former SBA administrator says the Treasury Department has been giving contradictory guidance to Maine banks trying to process loans under a newly created program. The Payroll Protection Program will provide loans to small businesses to continue paying employees who aren't working because of the pandemic. Those loans will be forgiven by the government if a business meets the requirements. Gene Hewlett was acting SBA administrator in the Obama administration and is now president of Maine Community Bank. She says her staff has been processing loan applications nonstop since the program was finalized last Friday. But she says they are hampered by the federal guidance they're getting. It's not only been slow in coming, it has been contradictory. Uh, the, this program uh, is really effectively, from my perspective, a grant program being administered through the banks, which the banks are not set up to do. And so the vehicle that they are using is the SBA 7A program, which this program is, bears no resemblance to. So Treasury statements about the program and its uh, intent is well uh, meaning and is uh, what the small businesses need, but the actual delivery channel through the SBA 7A program and through the banks is not as efficient and seamless as the Treasury Department believes. Hewlett urges businesses to get the necessary documentation to their lenders as quickly as possible. And she offers some perspective about the size of this new program. Hewlett says the SBA typically delivers about $30 billion of loans for this kind of program a year. The first day of this program, they did $35 billion.